And I'm going to tell you right now, I'm going to be, from the statement I'm about to make, I'm going to be called a racist. And I will be called every name under the sun. But somebody needs to stand up and speak to the black church. When the largest Pentecostal, when the largest African American Pentecostal denomination, when that leader stands up and said, I endorse that woman, he was saying, I endorse murder. I endorse homosexuality. I endorse lesbianism. I endorse transgenderism. I endorse every evil that hell could prosper or bring up to the right. That's wrong, folks. And the black church votes predominantly for the party that is anti-God. What's going on here? What's going on? See, my statement to them is this. We, we, we've had them call into the program. Yeast. I don't like it when you talk about it. Well, no, the problem is they don't like it because we're stepping on their toes. Hello? But I guarantee you, if 1860 was today, they wouldn't say a word about preachers preaching against slavery. They would trumpet it, and they should. So then, why will not the African-American church stand up for righteousness and stand up for the word?